Okay, this is a mantra that I haven't posted on the channel yet, but it is, it is definitely necessary to be on there because it affects all of us quite strongly. And this is the astrological planet known as Mars. Now, Mars um, it is not a planet of um, peace. <laughs> Although if, I'm sure if you're uh, extremely uh, harmonized with this planet, it would actually look exactly like peace. That's the irony of this kind of stuff and this kind of work. So what Mars is known for to assist you with is it assists you in protecting you from violence. Now, there are a lot of places in the world that are having, uh, you know, obviously a Mars type of energy problem. A lot of conflict, a lot of war, a lot of uh, danger, you know, for your physical well-being and so forth. So. Um, excuse me if I'm shivering just because it's, it's just really cold out right now <laughs> and the lighting is just ex nice outside so it's a lot nicer to do the videos outside than inside but uh, yeah if I'm shivering that's that's what's going on um, I need more Mars energy Mars actually helps with blood and blood flow and uh, I don't have a lot of that right now so uh, but anyway so to get back on the subject here Mars has to do with uh, protecting you from violence and making you an absolute perfect warrior uh, it increases muscular strength, increases uh, the strength of all your muscles. It increases your ability to flow, like your blood flow. It, it any uh, disease that has to do with the blood, uh, Mars would be effective in treating that type of disease. So, um, if you have iron deficiency, any of these types of things, Mars would be the perfect, uh, you know, planetary mantra for you to use in part of your healing practice. Um, I, I know flow of blood would probably have to do more with the sun or with the moon because moon is liquid and the sun is more to do with heart. Uh, but when it comes down to the blood itself, that is Mars, the, the astrology of Mars. That's, that's the, the planet you want to work with. Um, Mars also is good for adrenals and for the gonads and for the, the testosterone system. You know, anything that's responsible for producing testosterone. Um, it's also great for healing the masculinity in anyone, whether it's the masculine side of a woman or the masculine side of a man, it's, it would be the same thing. So it would still offer some very strong healing energy in that way. Now, I know there are other areas that, uh, that Mars assists with, but the reason why I'm posting this video is that there are a lot of people that have a lot of accidents, a lot of physical accidents. And... The Markandeya Mantra is very effective in reducing your accidents. That's the Markandeya Mantra. I have it posted on my YouTube channel. You can check it out. But it's a longer mantra and it may be intimidating to some people. So they might not want to learn that at this point. Well, Mars, because it protects you from violence, um, it may not protect you from the accidental violence as much as um, the conscious or on purpose type of violence. You know, those that are in inspired by anger and by conflict. But that said, because Mars is very physical, um, I do believe it would help um, offset a lot of the accident type karma because um, energy is energy and anytime you start to harmonize and pierce through um, the, the, the static, the energetic static where energies are conflicting and they're smashing into each other, Mars is known as a piercing energy. It helps with spiritual force. So it will help align energies that are not aligned. It's kind of like the head of a spear. That's, that, was, that would be Mars, the head of a spear, that this sharp point. So it gets right to the point of the matter. Um, you will notice when you chant this mantra, you may cleanse a lot of anger. Now, I know that that happened with me with the sun. Uh, the sun mantra was responsible for lots of cleanses. And I've talked to lots of people and a lot of people have had the same thing. A lot of irritation, anger when they chant the sun mantra for the first little while. Um, but Mars, I would say it would probably be the same uh, because Mars, that hot-blooded, you know, that hot-blooded type temper, you know, the things that lead to conflict. So what happens is you become free of these energies that lead you into conflict and then there's no conflict to have to win. You see, that, that so Mars would help you with this, it's not being drawn into these dangerous situations because of uh, um, thinking from the wrong place inside yourself, for not having mastery over your own peace or where to find it inside yourself. So uh, with that in mind, uh, here's the mantra. I'll, there's, there are a few ways of chanting the mantra. There is the, the short version. The short version of the mantra goes, Om Angara Kaya Namaha, 
Om Angarakai Yanamaha. Om Angarakai Yanamaha. Now, Angarakai sounds a lot like anger. So it's kind of a funny coincidence that Sanskrit would have a Angarakai in there, but it's, uh, it definitely would, it's an easy way to remember it. So just think Mars conflict, anger leads to conflict lots of times. Um, Mars is great for this. Now, the longer version of this mantra goes, and I'll chant it 108 times. It goes, Om Krum Kreen Kram Sa Bama Yanamaha. 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 
Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Kum King Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Om Krum Kring Kram Sa Ba Ma Na Ma Ha. Now just so you know, my camera shut off there as I was getting close to the end of the mantra, so I had to restart. Um, so you've, this is more than 108, this is probably 110, 120 um, uh, repetitions of the mantra. So 108, as you know, is, is what's required in order to get the minimum requirement for the energy to be invoked in your energetic system. So, uh, yeah, so this is perfect. So 108 in the morning, 108 at night. Uh, is the minimum, but what I usually do is I do japa, I chant a mantra all day and all night, and I just keep going. So, just so you know, though, and, and like I've said in other videos, but in case you haven't watched those videos, uh, if you start to cleanse like extreme emotional pain or anger, you know, this stuff, and it's just overwhelming for you, just just back off and take a break from the mantra for a day or two or a week or whatever it is you need, and then then get right back at it again. Um, but yeah, extremely effective stuff. So you'll you'll notice the emotional stuff will heal first, and then the physical things will start to happen. At least that's been my experience. Now, that said, there have been some people that just instantaneously, once they start invoking this energy, they notice physical symptoms of whatever uh, issue it is they're dealing with starts to change. Maybe relationships in their life. Maybe their job changes. Maybe. Um, friends and, and, and family become, you know, different dynamics right away. Um, but ultimately, just conduct your own experiments with the energy and see how that works out for you. All right. Thanks for listening, and uh, I'm freezing. <laughs> it's cold out today. <laughs> but thanks for, thanks for tuning in anyway, and, uh, and uh, yeah, I'll see you soon. Great.